Kari. Yeah. Let's take a look. Storm Track 8 turning outside as we look downtown. It is shaping up to be just a beautiful evening after a crisp start this morning. So nice. I mowed, I, I mowed today. Did today? Uh, on a Thursday, week. yes. Wow. Um, Ashley said it was going to be the best day of the week. I listened. I also uh, I'm going to be busy this weekend, so I had to get in. It was a good day to do it. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, you want to do it this week, I mean, today before the weekend because the weekend is definitely hot and humid. It um, might take you a little bit longer uh, to mow um, this weekend because mm -hmm. I know your, your electric lawnmower cuts off sometimes. It gets overheated, yes. It so does. it was smart to do it today. It was very smart. So, yes. Yeah. So looking good there. Um, I want that wasn't a dig. I, I didn't know that. It wasn't. It wasn't a dig. It yes, shuts it off. Happens quite often. I know it's an electric mower. <laughs> yes. I, you, yes. And I happen to like it. Yes. But <laughs> it, it, but it does overheat sometimes. Yeah. And it cuts off. We have one too, so I get it. Yeah. I get it. I get it. All right. Um, all right. So the forecast moving forward. I just glad you don't have the one that plugs in anymore because that one was. That was the the bane of my existence. Yes. That was very. Different. I, he used to have one that plugged in. He needed an extension cord to get around with. It's so. <laughs> very. It was like. Like I was vacuuming the, so, the so yeah grass. things have been you know it's better life is better but yes today was a good mowing day I've had a few people actually tell me that they mowed today um, but this is where we're going guys we're going back to heat index values in the upper 90s to near 100 it will feel like it's near 100 plus um, by Sunday even into Monday there so yes it was a good day to mow today tomorrow's still great and Saturday's not too bad we just increased the humidity over the area when we talk about August 90 degree days we average around five we've had three I do think we'll add at least two or three more uh, to August as we move forward here and we see a trend of heat and humidity coming back today. 76 degrees for Indy. It was a lovely day for us at 79 as we look to South Bend, 82 to the south in Evansville. Outside right now, we have sunshine. You can't tell in this shot, but we have sunshine. We have dry air. Temperatures are at 76. Feels like 77. Dew point still incredibly low at 49. So dry air for us. Clouds beginning to increase over the area. And I promised you yesterday when we had a chat that we would talk about the temperature change. Now, today, running 3 to 5 degrees warmer than yesterday at this time. It signifies a warming trend that we've been warning you about. And today, the warming trend only take, took us to the upper uh, 70s, right? Tomorrow, I think we'll get into the 80s, low to mid 80s in the forecast for you. So tonight, enjoy a comfortable night, pleasant conditions, a mix of sun and clouds at sunset, which happens at 830. Temperatures go from the 70s down into the 60s here. Tomorrow morning, waking up to the 50s once again, a little bit warmer, mid to upper 50s with sunshine and dry air to start. We'll increase the temperature trend the humidity and the uh, cloud cover over the day or throughout the day tomorrow. 77 at noon. Temperatures peak at 83. We will see southeast wind beginning to move into this forecast, bringing more humidity your way. By Saturday, the upper 80s, it will feel like the 90s. The extended forecast here shows several consecutive 90 degree days into next week with heat index values that are quite high. As we look into September, this model taking us into September. Uh, temperature outlook showing the temperatures will remain pretty warm in the extended forecast here. Hensley Legal Group seven day forecast. Things look great for the zone football on your Friday night. The weekend warming up and next week hot and humid every single day with an isolated chance for a stray shower or storm by midweek.